so I like that feeling of not having the necessity to check on, on the phone, and that happens to me in the countryside. Uh, what are two, of course, other than racing, things that you consider yourself to be very good at? <laughs> I mean, nothing gets to the level that we are performing at a race as a race driver. No, no. we did that all our, I mean, our lives. That we are very good at. Yeah. Like, very, very good. And we work day and night to be good at it. Exactly. Maybe not night. So everything that I say, apart from this, I am worse at it than at racing cars, of course. Yeah. I consider myself... Uh, golf? And yeah. More than golf, uh, a bit of a fast learner in sport. Yeah. So whatever sport I try, I kind of get to a decent level. And I say decent because, of course, I'm not an expert. But I can get to a decent level pretty good. So uh, golf, paddle, tennis, ski, um, uh, I don't know, whatever you say, I try and I immediately defend myself. Oh, so okay. totally. maybe a bit of a fast learner. You? I don't know. I, uh, I get what you say about sports and I think I also try and, and uh, do the things that if someone tries to learn me something, I try to, uh, how do you say that? Do that straight away. So if they ask me to change a movement like or a whatsoever. Challenge. Yeah, exactly. So. But uh, probably more my creative, creative part. I'm always thinking about new things, new projects, new whatever. So yeah, I'm very creative. You're quite into art, I thought, uh, music, music, and even business. Oh. Yeah, I mean, business is it's uh, still very early days. But I've got a lot of ideas, and I don't, I don't really get to do them because I haven't got much time. But yeah, every day I've got new ideas. So. Would you prefer to fly or to be invisible? To fly. Depends. Well, invisible. That's what, what, <laughs> what's your idea being? Yeah, going to see things. <laughs> it's a bit creepy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> being this car sounds awesome. Very creepy. Yeah. Very plain where you are not supposed Yeah, to that's actually quite cool. Flying, but I would like to fly fast. Teletransport oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. myself very quickly to places and not have to travel. So ah, yeah, for sure. I mean, if, if fly I fly at, at, at one kilometer per hour, I'd be like, okay, I'm flying, but I'm not I going anywhere. Walk. <laughs> I'd rather walk. <laughs> for what in your life do you feel most grateful? My selfish me wants to say being a Formula One driver and a but realistically, what I think I should be grateful for is to have uh, good health, that my family is healthy. We were born in a, with a very good life, very lucky life. And, and that's the first thing that, that is the most important, at least for me, being happy with my family, everyone being healthy. That's the first thing that should be most important, health, and then if I become a bit more selfish, I would say achieving my Formula One. Yeah, agree. I'm not going to ask you what because I think it's yeah, 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 not very similar. Just grateful also for my family to have give me the opportunity to now live from my passion. I think such a chance. One thing brings the other. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but yeah, to be able to live from your passion is something that we are really, really lucky to have. Do you have any family traditions? Yes, actually in Spain, I don't know if it's the Latin culture or what, but uh, we have a lot of family traditions. Uh, for example, before COVID, every Sunday, uh, my family uh, does some, like a lunch with my grandparents, my cousins, my uncles, aunties, so it's a lunch of 30 people every Sunday of the nice. year. Every Obviously, Sunday? Yeah, no, every Sunday of the year. Obviously now, I, there's not any more this lunch. And me personally, I couldn't attend to a lot because 22 races, 22 races a week, a year means uh, 22 weekends that I cannot go. But that is a very Spanish traditional thing that, that 
you have lunch with your family and then maybe you go with your cousins to, to, to cinema or you do that kind of nice yeah sunday family day yeah cool what do you think it separates true friends and just normal people that you meet you have a good relationship with but you don't really feel that connection that uh, attachment that you feel I don't know. To me, in Monaco, we are a group of eight. We are best friends since since child and uh, since school. Or? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, we've always been this group of eight, and we've always stayed very uh, oh, connected. Oh, that's the end of that run.